What are we even doing here? Nuri spiced mackerel in olive oil. It's like a free day when I get to do some Nuri stuff because I know it's gonna be good. I've never had their mackerel before. I'm pretty excited. My buddy Brad from uh, Mild Manor Everyday Carry sent me this ages ago, it seems. Product of Portugal, a nice classy wrapper. Let's check it out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, let's just set the expectation so high because um, we know it's going to be really good and, you know, I'm not going to have anything negative to say and, uh, you know, now we've created suspense because if I'm let down, oh my God, it's going to happen. Look at these. Isn't this the prettiest skin? Yeah, yeah, oh, and delicate too. Look how this just wants to come apart. Oh. Okay, they're kind of the size of sardines, but usually the mackerel I get is kind of, um, you get these big sort of sides that are, um, you know, I don't know. <laughs> I had some wild planet mackerel yesterday and um, uh, it was a bummer. Quit stalling. Another fish conquers. A little fat, great tasting olive oil, great tasting spices. Cloves in the house. Let's see if I can cut this open, huh? Yeah. Looks nice. Nice mackerel spine here. A lot thicker and stronger looking. Mm hmm You can feel those individual vertebrae crushing up. Mmm. Okay, a little on the mushy side, but then not um, stringy. Oh my god. Look at this beautiful silver and blue. I love the, the, the look of fish. That's part of the whole fun to open up these cans is it's like having an aquarium in your living room. Not that spicy, not that spicy. Let's have this little carrot. Pretty mushed out. That's fine. It's fine for carrots. This big guy. Is he bigger than the first one? Can we see any more on the inside? Oh yeah, look how clean he comes apart. Oh, look at this big old spine. Will it just lift out? Yeah, yeah, it kind of does. Woo. Calci, yum. I'm just, I'm just playing. I, I, you know, how much can you like crunching on bones? Like, let's not, let's not like act like an idiot here. Look at this fat, huh? Party down. I love it. The spice isn't as pronounced as basically the same recipe with the sardines. It's not. And it's kind of riding up in the back of my mouth, sort of in my throat a little bit, but. Mm. Yeah, you know. Maybe I wish that the meat was a little bit more organized. Is it as mushy as it is delicate? Perhaps. Maybe I'm a bigger fan of the, um, the sardines, the pilchards. Mm, little cucumber. Should we cheat and just have the little pepper here first? Love that. Man, I'm having a great time. I am having a great time though. Look at him. Just what a what a great color there. I don't know. Even though the skin's kind of beat up on this guy. Hmm. A nice flavor though. A nice flavor. Yeah, it's different from sardines. It is. I'm sorry, it's it's 
it's hard for me to describe the flavor of fish, you know? It's not as it's not as easy as like wine or beer or something where I can kind of break out one of those charts and tell you how nutty or fruity it is or, or whatever. I wish they had a little bit more definition, but God damn, they're so easy to eat. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna um, take a sip of the oil here. Just uh, people get on me. I don't talk about the oil. Indeed, I don't do anything with the oil. Okay. Not as full bodied an oil as the EVO that we keep around the house. Um, I don't know how much we pay for that stuff an ounce. You know, even if you got nice sardines, what kind of oil can you afford to put in this? You know, I don't know. Well, this is an easy one. Like I said, you do some Nuri Max, you have a great time, get them, try them out. What are you gonna try Nuri sardines and not try the mackerel? Of course not. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time. Bye bye.